Well, it's taken months, but the McGowan government has finally agreed to, to try smart drum lines in a bid to reduce the risk of shark attacks. The system will catch, tag and relocate predators at one of WA's most dangerous surf spots. A smart solution at one of our most notorious shark hotspots. Up to 10 smart drum lines like this will soon be installed off the coast of Gracetown. This program is not designed to kill sharks. After months of pressure, the McGowan government today announced a trial of the non-lethal boys. To catch, tag, relocate and then release sharks. Until now, the state government has said there's not enough scientific research that smart drum lines work, instead supporting and subsidising personal deterrent devices. This is a step in the right direction and finally they're listening to the people of Western Australia. Smart drum lines are anchored to the ocean floor. When a predator takes the bait, it sets off an alarm, sending a GPS alert to authorities so they can tag and release the shark. Gracetown was selected for the trial because of its long history of attacks, including two earlier this year, which forced the cancellation of the Margaret River Pro. It's a better option to drumline them than to kill them, but, um, yeah, it's, it's good to see the government doing something about it. Rick Gehring, brother of shark attack victim Ben Gehring, supports the trial. This is a new approach. The technology has been trialled over in New South Wales and Queensland as well with what seems to be a, a great success. When the trial is complete, the results will be analysed by the state's chief scientist to determine whether or not the technology does in fact make our beaches safer. The trial will cost taxpayers several million dollars. It's not yet known when the drum lines will be installed. Nathan Brooks... Nine News.